Minister of the Federal Capital Territory, Barsanye Sonwike, has stressed the need for Nigerians to pay their taxes, stating that government at all levels need to generate revenue to provide essential social services to the people. The minister made this statement at the opening ceremony of the Abuja Business and Investment Summit. Barrister Wiki emphasized that endorsing collective partnership in investment requires commitment from both private investors and the government to ensure all necessary requirements are met. ADBN FCT correspondent Naomi Oleribe completes the report. Minister of the Federal Capital Territory, Barrister Nyesom Wiki, while giving his address, said that while the government provides an enabling environment and infrastructure for investment, investors are also expected to contribute their share rather than expecting the government to shoulder the entire burden. The partner takes 80 percent or 90 percent and you want government to take 10 percent while well, I will provide the infrastructure. I said, my kind of arrangement is one-sided. So these are things I said, stop, don't talk well. Let's talk on this one that we have already agreed. Let's see how that, you know, uh, investors will always tell you they are putting in money. But I forget the fact that, too, government is putting in the infrastructure. Speaking on the theme of this year's event, optimizing investment through partnerships, Keynote Speaker and Governor of Anambra State, Professor Charles Soludo, said that the best way to grow Nigeria's investment sector is to promote the purchase of locally made products. And I want to say that we must, first point I make here is that we must intentionally, the whole agenda of also Nigeria first, Philosophy as a philosophy is something that we must This will require us to intentionally nurture national champions for sustainability. Earlier in her opening speech, Group Managing Director of Abuja Investment Company Limited, Dr. Maureen Tamuno, stated that building strong partnerships will optimize investments and drive Nigeria's economic prosperity well this summit is aimed at promoting investment opportunities in fct as well as creating a platform for networking among investors from within nigeria and beyond i am confident that our crop of carefully selected and notable panelists would provide insightful and thought-provoking ideas that will break new grounds for economic prosperity the summit aims to catalyze economic growth and development within the FCT as the nation strengthens its position in the global economy. Naomi Oleribe, ADBN News.